Hey there guys, Dr. Opran is here and in this video I'm gonna show you how to make millions of silver just by doing tracking. In this video I'm gonna show you what I learned from tracking in early hours of this update and how you can do it better if you are a solo player. Let's go! First of all, let's talk about how to do tracking in Albion Online. To do tracking, you need tracking toolkits. It's easy. You will type track in Marketplace and you see tracking toolkits from tier 3 to tier 8. It's like gathering. If you bring tier 3 tracking toolkit, you can hunt animal up to tier 4. If you bring tier 4 toolkit, you can hunt animals up to tier 5 and etc. Every toolkit gives you a bonus in tracking efficiency. Once you go higher in tier of that toolkit, you can get tracking efficiency. As you can see, it goes higher and higher and from tier 4 up to tier 8 you will have tracking fame bonus and that's great once you go higher in tier that toolkit will search a higher amount of radius for you like for example you see in tier 4 it searches 200 meter radius but in tier 8 you can see it searches 300 meter radius it makes tracking easier if you go with high tier as you saw i cannot pick up tier 5 to tier 8 tracking toolkits here's the question how to unlock them as you can see in the destiny board you will see a new line trainee tracker once you track animals in tier 3 and accomplish it you will unlock the trainee tracker and you can now use tier 4 tracking toolkit it's totally like gathering but in another way once you tracked more and more animals with tier 4 tracking toolkit you will level it up to level 10 and unlock tier 5 and then tier 6 tier 7 and then tier 8. The question you can ask is why I should level up my season tracker or every piece of these tracking lines to level 100. As you can see every level of these lines will give you a passive bonus. And what's that? For example, take a look at downbird tracking specialist. Once you killed and tracked down birds too much, again and again you will level this up to 100. But for one level, you will have bonus to tracking efficiency when interacting with tracks. I don't know exactly what is efficiency, but maybe it's about a loot or something like this. Second one is bonus to tracking efficiency when interacting with downbird tracks. It will give you plus 1 to downbird tracking and 0.1 to all of the tracking lines. And the third one is 0.75% bonus chance to engage. If you go with more than 3 players, the animal will escape. So to skip this in mind. As you can see, the game asked me to go to the marked location and your hunt now begins. You will go step by step and you will have to kill the animal step by step. You will hunt it down step by step. Sometimes the animal will escape and you will have to go in another zone to find him or go into another sign to track him down. You guys may ask, 
why I cannot find any animals I'm just searching for 30 minutes one hour we are in the early hours of the new update so with considering that everyone are tracking tier 3 to tier 5 animals you will have your answer so to increase your chance to find animals you can go deep and deep in black zones this way you can escape from gankers that are flooding into the black zones with the new updates the rewards for killing these animals can vary you can be lucky and get the artifact parts for making new weapons and you can be unlucky to have just a tome and some rare animal remainings which costs nothing at all Albion Online is a dangerous place for the solo players, especially in open port. If you are a solo player who wants to do tracking and make millions of silver by that, just keep this in mind, you should go with proper sets. And what is a proper set for tracking? 1. You should have sustainability. Keep this in mind, some trackings and some animals like werewolf are really really difficult to kill. So bring some healing potions, for sure omelette if you have healing build or soup and a sustainable build. You can use mercenary jacket or healer builds like nature staffs or even one-handed dagger for that matter. But keep this in mind, with the new updates, gankers are flooding into the maps, and so many players and so many guilds are coming back to gank new players. Keep this in mind, to use minor work boots for more and more protection and assassin jacket can work in a good way you can use mage cow and me myself use blight staff as a good weapon you can use one-handed dagger or even blood litter with mercenary jacket to have more sustain and one other thing do not go with high ip and go with low amounts of IP and go with a sustainable build and go with a low cost build. How much profit can you earn in the early days of this update? I can say you can earn infinite amounts of silver just by doing tracking with low IP set with low risk of losing so much silver as you can see these are tier 3 rewards in animals that you can hunt in early tiers of your tracking let's see how much does it cost to buy as you can see there are so many buy orders on 260k both of silver and the average price for this one is 360 and this one is 390 and this one is 311 k of silver let's go and see for example tier 5 fine shadow class is about 700 20k worth of silver and the average price is about 600 let's go and see tier 7 it's about 1 million of silver per each and that's great guys if you have a group of three players or even you are a slow player you can level up your tracking line and go earn some money thank you guys for watching this video i hope you enjoy please do not forget to participate in the giveaway subscribe to the channel and leave a like good luck see you in the next video